Hey, what up? How's it going? Today we're going to go over uh, kind of a Halloween drawing, or kind of a Halloween, a Halloween drawing. It's going to be one of my favorite things ever, which is peanuts. Peanuts, like Snoopy, Charlie Brown, all of that, um, Linus, um, Great Pumpkin. That stuff is one of my favorite, uh, I don't know what you call it, franchises or something like that, like ever. I love, love, love Snoopy, love the new cartoon. So this is kind of dear to my heart. Um, but yeah, so that's it. We're going to draw Snoopy in a Halloween kind of pumpkin outfit. And I'm going to draw a lot of peanuts because I love, love peanuts. Um, this is going to be simple, easy for beginners. So definitely stick around all the way to the very end. It's going to be relatively short, under eight, under 10 minutes for sure. Uh, so that's pretty much it. By the end of the video, you should be able to know how to draw Snoopy from your mind. Um, I'm gonna be using this, Cruella brand uh, marker and regular printing paper. And this is all you need, by the way. You can buy this stuff like at the store or I can put a link for you on Amazon. And this is just paper you can get anywhere. Okay, let's jump into this, all right? Before that, don't forget, hit the subscribe. Uh, this is, I post every day here. Uh, and all right, let's get started. I'm gonna throw a line across the top over here. Because Snoopy's gonna be in a costume and, uh, and it's gonna have a flat hat for that. So the flat line over here of the hat. Then I'm gonna pull the top of the pumpkin. So it's kind of like the cap of the pumpkin. Like there, from one side. Right here for the other side. I'm gonna hear the top. Right there, for the stem. Down. Really, really, really simple stuff, right? Really simple shapes. And don't worry if it's a little different. Let's say yours is like a little bit longer over here or shorter over here, whatever, or the stem is straight up. Doesn't really matter. You know, what we're doing is we're capturing the spirit of something, right? It's not, it doesn't have to be like a clone or anything like that. I'm gonna go over here to this side and draw Snoopy's ear coming from the left side. He's gonna have his, is he right here? Like there, kind of like a J shape or something, or like a backwards J. Go over here to the bottom of the face, pulling in, down. I'm gonna go over here to the front, and I'm gonna pull, like over here, I'm gonna pull a little bit of a curve down, and I'm gonna draw that big nose, or the big snout area, because I know they make fun of having a big nose sometimes. Right on, and I'm gonna pull in. Now I'm gonna draw a little smiley. Well, I mean, it's kind of a smiley, but it's what it is is actually, it's the other side of Snoopy's mouth, pretty much, right? Because he's a dog. I'm gonna go over here at the end around this area, and I'm gonna draw his nose, just like a black dot for his nose. And I'm gonna go over here and draw his eyes. Like, and the eye, the eyes are smaller. The dots for the eyes are smaller, okay? So just kind of keep that in mind. Sweet. Maybe a line here for his brow. So we're gonna, in this, we're gonna draw another shape on the inside. So we have that line there. And we are gonna kind of, just kind of draw that shape and fill that in because that's gonna be the dark part of his ear which really gives him his type, right? I never had a beagle before. I wonder if those are nice nice dogs. If anybody has one, let me know. So now let's draw the Halloween outfit. I'm gonna draw from here to here, and it's gonna be like this bubble shape all the way across. Right on. Curve over here. So we'll go down, in. We're in this side, down, in. It's got that little uh, pumpkin body curve over here. This bubble shape as well on the bottom of that. Obviously what these are, they're the striations of the pumpkin, you know? So let's draw the face of the pumpkin up here, up here, down, down, line in, line in. triangle. Okay, now I'm going to draw a straight line across, downward here for a tooth, and then keep drawing straight line across. 
So think about what's going on here. These are literally simple shapes, right? This is literally a triangle, 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 you know, like turned into different ways, essentially. Down here like that, we have a curve across. So now we got this cool little smiley face thing. And I'm gonna fill this in entirely because it's an outfit, right? He's not gonna have like a candle in there because he's in it. Um, I guess it could be colored on the outside. Alrighty, and I'm gonna draw little lines here, which they what they what that is is a striation of the pumpkin. Down here for the tail. Let's draw the hand on this side, hand on this side. Line here for his hand reaching out. Circle there for his thumb. A little bit of a, like, it's kind of a circle for the next finger, but it's kind of long too. So I wouldn't quite, you know, call that a circle, but it's 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 something like a circle, you know? It's just this little digit. And out here, it looks like a little marshmallow or something stuck to a hand. And pulling in. Gonna go this side. Gonna do the same thing for the thumb, circle. And these other ones are going to be more marshmallow-like, even though they pretty much look the same. Okay. Going to go down here for the feet. Line down, line down. And the feet are, they look like loaves of bread, honestly. So at least as a shape in general. Something like that, right? It looks like a loaf of bread. Down here as well, that shape. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna throw a line like these two lines here to make, you know, the pause, essentially. Oh, I'm also gonna draw some lines right here in the hat, I forgot about that, it's supposed to be the same. It's supposed to be made of the exact same thing, right? So that is pretty much it. Uh, as far as color goes, you can uh, add color if you like. I'm going to, I am going to color it a little bit. I'm going to use one colored pencil, and that's it. This little bitty one here, and I'm going to sharpen it here, and I'm going to do it right in front of you. Where is this? Uh, but this is pretty much the end of the lesson. Um, this is all extra stuff I'm doing now. I'm going to just color this pumpkin here. Oh, snap. We'll see if this works, because this thing is barely surviving. This, this colored pencil is tiny. I need to buy new ones. Uh, if anybody wants to donate, uh, go to the PayPal over there and donate because every single thing, that every donation I get, I use on tools for the channel. And uh, for example, like editing, uh, the, the art supplies, everything like that, it, it helps out a lot. You'd be surprised. So I'm still doing this. So like I said, this is all extra. See, this is so small and so broken, I have to push my finger on the bit of it just to kind of get any use out of it. Uh, so one thing I forgot to uh, mention, this is all extra stuff, guys, is if you want to, if you want the free gift, by the way, I put a free gift for you in the description. Go to the top uh, link in the description and you will see a link there. And what that is, is it's free Halloween templates so these are drawing templates that i've worked on for a while and i put them on a single file there so there's over a hundred drawing templates this actually used to be a product on the channel but i decided to give it out free so that's what i'm doing it's my gift to you it has been kind of a rough year uh they are ready to print basically they're made to print so that's pretty much, see, I got that color in there. So, and I'm going to fill in the stem, by the way, it's completely dark. So go check out those templates. It's 100% free, okay? That's it. Thank you so much. Uh, if you want more peanuts drawing, and I hope you do, uh, let me know. I'll talk to you later, all right? Oops. All right, see you later.